Hello and welcome. Now in this video I'm going to be uh, showing you how to connect your JV or your S2 member membership to JVZoo and this is a question from an associate of mine inside of a mastermind that I'm in so uh, hopefully this will be helpful uh, to to them and this will be helpful to you also if you are just watching on YouTube. Now you probably already have uh, your WordPress installed you probably already have s2 member installed and so I'm gonna assume that you do and what you're gonna want to do is to go inside of s2 member and I'm gonna show you a couple of things that you are going to want to have before you go into uh, JVZoo now once you're inside of s2 member you are gonna go to your side panel here and what you're gonna do is you are going to go into the link that says PayPal buttons here now obviously I've got it open there so just click that link S2 member is gonna bring you to a page that looks like this and then the next link you're gonna go to is gonna be your PayPal IPN integration so uh, we're gonna open up that link and then the next link that you're gonna open up in order to connect it with JVZoo is gonna be your IPN with proxy key so let's go ahead and click that you're gonna have this long URL here and you're gonna need that entire URL so what you're gonna to want to do is once you get everything set up inside of JVZoo um, you are going to then want to copy this entire URL now this is gonna make sense once you get inside of JVZoo and you actually are creating a product so let's now move to JVZoo Now inside of JVZoo, I'm going to assume that you've already created your product. And what you're going to do is you're going to then click the PayPal button here. You're going to make sure that's checked. And you are going to then want to open up your external program integration. You're going to go to method 4 inside of JVZoo because it is specifically designed for S2 member. Now you'll notice that uh, the directions in JVZoo are for you to go to the place we just went to inside of PayPal and we're gonna get that long URL and then we're gonna place it inside of the uh, inside of the text field here now one thing that you're gonna to wanna to do and this is important uh, it won't work right without it um, there is inside of this long URL there's a place where uh, you've got some uh, you've got some text that says proxy gateway you want to replace that and you can replace that with anything right so it doesn't have to be uh, you don't have to code it with anything it's just that the words proxy gateway uh, will not uh, will not generate what you need to to do in order to connect so just change out this word just like they say here okay so in your s2 member custom field you're gonna put gain mind share dot info and uh, depending on what uh, user level uh, this product is going to bring people to you're going to want to put that level in here okay and so once you've done that then what's going to happen is that every time somebody goes to actually buy this product with this uh, with the buy button that you create with this product in JVZoo they're going to get auto registered for your membership now um, in this video I'm not showing you how to create the monthly or, or monthly recurring membership I'll do that in another video but this is basically a video showing you where the connection points are okay so you're gonna go inside of your JVZoo product here and then you're also gonna go um, here inside of s2 member now obviously some of these things I've got blurred out um, and uh, you will you will find these once you are actually putting your entire product together now what I'm uh, what I'm thinking is as I'm doing this uh, for some of you uh, putting a membership together an S2 member is probably going to be a challenge and I remember it is an extreme challenge for me when I first did it so what I may do is I may do a series of videos uh, that will walk you through this process of 
setting up inside of S2 member and then connecting it to JVZoo. It's probably the best uh, connection that I've come across to make things easy for you. So you can actually get your entire product set up um, inside of JVZoo. And then you can sell that product any place. You can sell the product on the Warrior Forum. You can sell the product on your website. You can sell it just about anywhere once you understand how this process is set up. Okay, but now you know how to integrate both JVZoo and uh, your PayPal uh, and and your your, pay, your PayPal account inside of S2 Member. So with that, thanks, and I will actually see you in another video, and uh, be on the lookout for an entire series on first S2 member, and then getting that product connected inside of JVZoo.